This is a $10.5 million modern mansion with ocean views, amazing infinity edge pool, and we're about to check out the entire thing right now. So let's get started. property is set nicely above the street level, beautiful modern architecture, and upon entering the pedestrian gate, we have access here into this large walkway with beautiful views of your water feature, and more importantly, over here on my right, the views of the amazing ocean there in the distance. And coming up these stairs here, you can see that we have been led over into your front yard pool area, halo awning above, bringing natural light into this section all day long. You got a fountain displayed on my right. And down below, you also have that two car driveway leading you into your glass paneled five car garage area with private elevator access. And then on my left, you also have backyard access. We'll cover this section more a little bit later in the video, but I wanna take you inside of this section. Coming in, you've got your wooden paneled pivot door further taking you into the great room section. And the first detail that I wanna to talk to you about right here, this is going to be access into your private elevator, taking you down below into the five car garage area. You've got porcelain tile floors inside your very own elevator. And then this section is also mirrored up to the ceiling. Really nice and modern. Here are the specs of the property and a huge thank you to Max, the listing agent for allowing us to do this tour for him. Now, I wanna to talk to you guys all about your amazing great room upon entering the property. Of course, we've got extremely high ceilings, over 12 feet in height, porcelain tile floors finished in a gloss material. Looks amazing surrounding the entire first level. Staging displayed all throughout the section. It gives it a nice modern feel. Right here, linear gas fireplace displayed in the center of this section. It's actually two separate fireplaces right here, clad with the marble details, floating off the ground, adds a nice modern touch. And then of course, when you're relaxing in this great room, you're hit head on with the views of the ocean there in the distance palm trees. This property feels very tropical. If someone told me I was in Costa Rica, I'd probably believe them just because of how gorgeous this space looks. Now, continuing our tour, we've got your formal dining room section where you can sit up to six of your guests and then up above modern light fixture complements the room extremely well. Now, as I said, it's an extremely open concept floor plan. The space just leads you straight down into your well-appointed kitchen area. You've got breakfast bar seating for up to four of your guests at your marble waterfall edge countertop, light fixtures suspended above the space, really modern design. And on my right-hand side, you've got this LED strip lighting that automatically turns on when you open it and then close it up and those automatically turn off. Pretty cool little detail. All the cabinetry was designed by Cucina Mia. And I wanna show you this specific cabinet door as well. So you actually have this ergonomic pull-out shelving space in pretty much all of the doors over here. And you just nicely close that up. Really cool, I love seeing those in properties. And then all these doors are also soft closing as well. Thought I should mention that. And we continue through, you have dark natural wooden tone cabinetry all throughout this kitchen area. Right over here, you've got your panel dishwasher section, modern sink situated right in front of me, overlooking the views while you're washing your dishes. Also wanted to show you this little feature. So on either side of your six burner stove top, you've got little built-in spice storage areas. Close that up. Those are also soft closing too. But as I mentioned, six burner wolf gas stove. You've got the hood integrated into your cabinetry. Continuing on through, we got some more ergonomic pull-out shelving spaces. And then right here, we've got your sub-zero fridge and freezer section located on either side of your built-in wolf design microwave, oven, and warming tray displayed right below that. Now let's continue our tour over down through this section. On my right hand side, we are gonna be led over into your powder room area. And what I love most about this powder room is not just the floating vanity, but look at this sink design. I mean, yes, this is actually a faucet mounted up onto the ceiling. If you come a little closer, this is how you turn it on with this little interesting switch. You want hot water, you turn it this way. You want cold water, you turn it this way. It's literally mounted up on the ceiling. I mean, seriously, how cool is this? The sink actually flows downward into some linear drainage down below. 
beautiful marble details and your LED backlit mirror, which is curved. I mean, seriously, how cool is this? Now, let's continue our tour down through this section right over here. And on my left-hand side, we have this French door access leading you into your primary bedroom suite. Before we check out the main bedroom and the views, I wanna take you first into the primary bathroom section. Modern design all throughout, porcelain tile floors, floating double vanity section with two sinks, and you have this artistic quad mirror design. Every mirror is also backlit as well in this section. I mean, this is just absolutely gorgeous. Something else I also wanted to mention too, this is your freestanding tub area, and you have this unique marble tiling going up to the ceiling complemented well with this beautiful little light fixture mounted right above that. Also, you've got your glass enclosed walk-in shower space, built-in body sprays, and also what's interesting, you control the shower from the outside of it, not the inside. Not sure why they did it, but pretty interesting. Now let's close up that section, and also we gotta come this way, and this is where we have access into your primary closet area. Not complete with any built-ins, but it is a blank canvas for the future owner of this home to design it however they like. Also, one more thing I gotta show you. Come through here, and then we've got your automatic toilet when you first walk in. This is your water closet, even a little marble detail in your water closet. Pretty cool. Also, I like how they staged a little seating section in your bathroom, pretty cool. Now let's continue our tour over here and we are led into your well-appointed primary bedroom suite. We've got this custom stonework extending nearly up to the ceiling, built-in fireplace. Of course, you've got views of your fountain, your infinity edge pool, and then also something else I wanted to talk about too is that you have access into a private little patio area with seating sections and you also have turf design on the backside of that area. Now let's continue our tour back into the main hallway as I said, you've got the French doors further taking you in. And here we have your open atrium design taking you up to level two. You have these customized light fixtures specifically made for the property. You've got the glass panels taking you up. Beautiful open area, skylights bringing in natural light all day long. Now on my left-hand side, you've got your laundry room with space for a washer and dryer, of course, tons of custom cabinetry. And continuing our tour over here, we're led into the first guest bedroom of the property. First entering, you're just hit head on with the ocean views here in La Jolla. And this space is complete with your very own ensuite bathroom. You've got a floating vanity, mounted mirror, custom tile work all throughout, glass enclosed, walk-in shower space, mounted rain head. I mean, you've got everything in here. Also, right behind this section, you have walk-in closet area. Now that is pretty much gonna wrap up our tour for this entire first level, but of course, we have to check out the front yard pool and the backyard before we see level two, so let's get into it. Continuing our tour, we are led into the ultra-modern backyard section. First entering the area, you've got your infinity edge pool overlooking the ocean views in the distance. And connected to this pool, you also have a hot tub situated on the right-hand side. And all that water does flow into the space, creates a nice little secondary water feature. You've got these artistic spheres surrounding the property, as I mentioned earlier halo awning above, and it's programmed to actually close up with the press of a button. If the future owners do want to install that, they can. You've got your pool chairs staged right over here, access into the private patio that we saw a little bit earlier, turf area leading you over into your outdoor shower section, which is nicely tiled. Look at the unique 3D tile they've put on this. I mean, that's pretty remarkable attention to detail. If you want to shower out here, you can absolutely do it. Beautiful foliage surrounding this entire section more stage seating areas, outdoor fireplace, ideal for entertaining, and then that roof line actually cantilevers over this side of the property, providing some additional shade when you're entertaining guests out here on a hot and sunny day. And then your property line is actually up there where that fence is, so you have all of this additional landscaping as a part of your property, which adds plenty of privacy. Now, continuing our tour, you've got your built-in outdoor kitchen setup. You've got your little refrigeration space right under here. Next to that, we've got your outdoor barbecue and then additional grill station over here. Now, one more little thing that we have to talk about, open this up and we've got your pool bathroom space right over here, self-explanatory area. We've got the 3D tile on the far side of the wall, complete with your floating vanity. 
Now that's pretty much it for the front yard pool and the rest of the backyard. So now we gotta head upstairs, so let's do it. Now we are just up at the landing of level two, as we saw a little bit earlier, open atrium design, artistic skylights above, and these custom light fixtures designed by William Leslie, local artist here in San Diego. This just looks so beautiful. All the glass panels lining the section as well, making it very modern. And then we'll see a continuation of those porcelain tile floors. Now this space takes us into your upper level rooftop, which we'll see in just a second. But I wanna take you inside of this room and this is gonna be access into a guest bedroom. And I mean, you're just hit head on with these gorgeous ocean views in La Jolla. Let me open this up. Got a nice little seating section staged out here. It's also clad nicely with these glass panels. So you still get that modern design, views of your foliage behind you. And then on the left, amazing ocean views. Now let's continue our tour. Also, if you take a look at the floors right here, these are not the porcelain tiles. This is gonna be more of an engineered hardwood. These are gonna be found in all of the bedrooms because it's just a lot more cozy. Now, coming in here, we've got the ensuite bathroom, floating vanity, custom wooden cabinetry, and it's all, of course, soft closing. You've got an interesting tiled backsplash right over here covering this entire side of the wall, and then come into the shower space, and it actually is a continuation of that shiny porcelain tile that we've been seeing. Now, let's continue our tour outside of this section. Also, you have mirrored closets on either side when you first walk in, so twice the amount of storage. And let's continue our tour over to my left-hand side. And here we're gonna have access into another guest bedroom. You've got a walk-in closet on my right and then located right next to that section, we've got your ensuite bathroom, glass enclosed walk-in shower space. Come in here for a second because I wanna show you this unique tile work that they have all the way up to the ceiling, this really cool 3D design. Never really seen that before built-in bench seating, and of course, rain head displayed right above. And then upon entering, you also got the floating vanity. And check out this little detail really quick too. So you press the button and then you can change the color of the backlit. And then you can also defog it in case you're taking a hot shower, it gets all steamy. This will prevent it from getting all cloudy. Never seen that before, but that's really cool. Now continuing through, I almost forgot to mention, Entering this room, you're hit head on with the ocean views, of course. And then just like the last balcony we saw, you open up this beautiful sliding door, taking you out to the views. Absolutely amazing. Now let's continue back inside of this section. Over here on my left-hand side, we're led into the last bedroom here on the upper floor. And as I said, you've got this slider door taking you out to that exact same balcony that cantilevers over the property. Now, right over here, We've got your walk-in closet area. It's kind of like the primary suite. It's a blank canvas for the owner to decide how they want to design it. And then next to the space, we come in and we've got the ensuite bathroom space, floating vanity, glass enclosed, walk-in shower space with vertical tiling going up to the ceiling and your mounted rain head. Now we have to go check out that back side of the outdoor rooftop. So let's do it right now. So here we are up at the rooftop. You've got a continuation of that cantilever design with the wood clad, as we've seen earlier. Beautiful landscaping up here on this section. Honed porcelain tile floors all throughout. Nice staging around. And of course, while you're up here, I mean, you just get the absolute best views of the ocean there in the distance. Now, one more thing I also wanted to talk about is that you have this outdoor entertainment space complete with your very own built-in refrigeration right down below, all of the racks pull out. And then you have a spot for a mounted flat screen TV that will be added soon. And that is pretty much gonna wrap up our tour for this entire newly constructed property located here in La Jolla, California. If you stuck around until the end, of course, I wanted to say a huge thank you. Huge thank you to the listing agent, Max, for allowing us to do this tour for him. And thank you to the construction team. You can find all of their information down in the description of this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below, hit the bell, and I'll see you in the next one.